30. Go on around you can know you're not quite score today though well Messling's going along extremely well today fourth last week in Austria so that's found his form 175 yards the third Again, sign someone swinging well if they hit the ball constantly pin high and he's been doing that so far today Saw the tee shot of Bessling. This to get to 12 under and within two of Ollison. Bessling up the hill, second shot, par five, fourth. He's 11 under. Good shot here. We'd see him get within one of the lead. He could get it in nice and close. Where is it? Go on. Oh, no, it's fast from there. Bessling off a down slope behind the fourth. Brilliant. To Will Besseling, eyeing up another birdie putt. Yeah, there should be no problem at all here for Besseling to jump from 11 under to 12. Yes, no problem. He moves alongside Roussel, Kiefer and Schwab now. Now seems to be bucking that trend, going nicely this afternoon. Just 106 yards, this fifth hole. Yeah. Wrestling for another birdie to close it in one of Ollison. Going very nicely, isn't he? Will Besling. At the sixth. He's at 13 under. Well played. Nicely played. Well, he's been a bit of a birdie machine today, has the Dutchman. This one for Parr, coming off that top five finish last week at the... Austrian Golf Open. Now, this is a little tester. Just trust your hands, keep your head still. Try not to look up. Good stroke. Yes, well done. All round, good putt. to tie the lead for Besling. No, not to be in that one. Never mind, he's going to have two more chances, probably the way he's playing, the eighth and the ninth. Well, Besling then started his round at the tenth. Currently seven under with two to play. Second shot to eight. And again, fired straight at the pin. Bessling just over the green at the eighth hole. It's on his approach. Maybe misjudge the damn breeze a little. Got a gust. Using the putt as a great effect. Bessling continues his progress without a bogey. Bessling at his final hole of the day. 
13 under one behind the lead. Second shot up the hill here at the ninth. Go on, running out, coming out of the rough. Yes, beautiful stuff. He might just join Wallison at the top of the leaderboard. What a beautiful shot that was to finish. He won't know how close that is. Well, we're hearing that that wasn't uh, Bestling's second shot. That was his third, so a lot of trouble off the tee. So this, the 13 under. Still be a fine four if he holds it, and he has done. Yeah, well done. 63 round in today. Very good, 13 under, 64, 63 to start with. Well, fantastic today, 64, 63, your current lowest tournament round. How are you feeling? Feeling good, um, enjoyed it. Two great rounds, um, sun is out, of course good. So uh, playing well and uh, looking forward to the weekend. You took the scenic route, the adventurous route on the 18th, which is the 9th. Talk us through that one. Um, I pushed it, my drive, hit the car path, got into the water hazard, which is where there's no water, only, only rocks, and decided to play it from there. Um, so hit it, it went all the way right, onto the first hole into the rough, at 66 meters and flopped it to six foot and hold the putt. Wow, that's pretty <laughs> impressive stuff. So you're one of the few to not have dropped a shot so far in the field. What's been your real strength over the past two days? Um, I think it's very easy. I mean, the course is fairly easy. It's, it's, it's wide, there's not too much wind. Uh, there's a little bit, but not much. And this, this course is built for the wind. So if there's no wind, um, you're going to make birdies. And that's what happened. So I think it's really important to, to stay patient and, and, you know, see your chances. And also when you're not in position, uh, just uh, play a little more uh, defending. And uh, that's what we did. So together with my caddy, we did a great job so far. And um, that's why we don't have any bogeys yet on the cart. And hopefully we can keep it away for two more days. Hopefully it stays that way. You finished fourth last week in Osher. Did you have any sense of expectation going into this week at all? Um, no, it's the first time for me on, on the island, actually. So I had no idea how the course was going to look like. Um, but uh, I mean, sun is shining. We uh, we play in Polos again, uh, where last week uh, wasn't even close. So it's good to uh, good to uh, be out here and uh, and playing well. And keep up the great work. Thank you. Thank you very much. To watch another European Tour video, click here, and to subscribe, click here.